Remember that as a recommended black belt, you will need to be able to pass your fitness test. Make sure you're training for your 5K run and written test on your own, but this will be an instructional video on how to perform your fitness test. Remember that for your black belt fitness test, you will have to perform push-ups, sit-ups, combinations, kicks, and punches. For your push-ups, the important thing to remember is that your body goes down at a 90 degree angle for regular push-ups, or that your body stays straight for a zero base. For your regular push-ups, you'll have your hands on the floor, about a shoulder width apart, feet behind you, body straight, looking forward, bending your arms at a 90 degree angle, and pushing up. It's important to make sure that your bottom doesn't go in the air or sag towards the ground as you're doing your push-up. For a zero base alteration, you're going to drop your body to the floor, knees never touch the ground, arms lift up as you launch yourself up for a zero base push-up. For your sit-ups, it's important to remember to take your body from all the way down to all the way up. With a regular sit-up, you want to make sure that your elbows go from your knees, shoulder blades right beside the ground, and lifting back up till your knees touch your elbows. If you're performing zero base sit-ups, remember to sit in a butterfly stance as your arms fold back, touch the ground behind you, and stretch up to touch in front of your toes for a full zero base sit-up, looking like that. Kick combinations for your black belt fitness test are a combination of warrior combos number 17 and 18. Remember that your left leg always starts in front. The first combination is a front leg front kick, a back leg round kick, and then putting that foot in the back where it came from, performing a reverse back kick, setting the foot back down where it came from. Left leg is always in the front at the end of your combination. Combination number two is a back leg front kick, setting in the back, a switching jump round kick, setting in the back, and a reverse side kick. This is the only kick that stays in the front rather than returning to where it came from. Put together, the warrior combinations will look like this, with a front leg front kick, back kick, back kick, front kick, switch round kick, and reverse side kick to finish out one warrior combination. For your combinations, remember that you are doing a jab cross number two round kick on each side of your body. Working with my partner, I'm using my front hand first, remember that's your jab, to perform a jab, cross, number two round kick, and then switching to the other side, jab, cross, number two round kick for one combination. Remember that for your black belt fitness test, hand combinations are a combination of warrior combos one through four. This is a jab, a jab cross, a cross hook cross, and a jab, cross, hook, cross. All together will look like this. Jab, jab, cross, 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 jab, cross, hook, cross for one full combination.